Yo, what up, YouTube? It's your boy, DJ Brads, with another video, and uh, I actually got two dislikes on my previous one, so I have no idea why. So now I will be showing you how to install a Remote Play 1.1 patch if you have a non Sony uh, laptop. That's why we got the patch, and this time I will be doing it with proof. Alright, so first, what I'm gonna need you to do is download this file. In the link is in the description, and uh, it is an ad file, so just skip the ad, and it will be redirected to Media Fire. So you wanna download that? What you wanna do is you extract. If you are on Windows, you want to extract the Remote Play 1.1. If you are on Mac, uh, you want to extract the Mac OS X. And if you are on Mac, just do what I do in the video. It's the exact same process, just that I'm going to use the Windows. So let me extract that. And once you have extracted that, you can get rid of that. So yeah, open that. And what you want to do is first run this program right here. As you can see, it is EP0000248680. So you want to run that. Just click yes. And it will install. Alright, once that is done, you want to click on finish. And then what you want to do is actually go to your computer local disk C and go to your your program files and what you want to do is scroll down to Sony remote play with PlayStation 3 and you want to copy these two files right here into there and continue that move and then when you wanna open Sony you wanna use this RMP underscore launcher you don't wanna use the application it will not work so you wanna launch it through that and there you go it's working so now this is the part I didn't do in my last video and I'm gonna do it now I'm actually pay my PlayStation so let's go next uh, let's just put Brad. let's go next so now as you can see it asks you for an 8 digit number so what you want to do is go to your playstation you want to go to settings scroll down to remote play which is second to last you want to click on remote play click on register device scroll down to pc and it should give you an 8 digit number which expires in 300 seconds so you want to what you want to do is enter that in 886275 what you want to do is click on next and now as you can see the register device process is complete so now the playstation is registered and it should send you a message on the playstation to say register completed so what you want to go to now is scroll to um, your network on your PlayStation. You want to go down to Remote Play and just press X. Then the message should come up saying that it is waiting for you to pay. So now what you want to do is click Connect on the laptop. It's communicating, and there you go. You connect it. As you can see, it's 100% connected. And uh, yeah, that's how you do it. So please guys like comment subscribe and if I can as you can see right now if you try play okay 90% of the cool games that you really want to play uh, on compatible as you can see I'll try launch FIFA 16 as you can see this content cannot be used during remote play but if I can get um, if I can get uh, 1,000 likes and 1,000 subscribers, I will release a video on how to get 
GTA 5, FIFA 16, all the cool games, Black Ops 3. I will show you how to get it working on remote play, uh, official firmware and custom firmware. I will release both files. So yeah guys, share this video, like this video, subscribe to my channel. I set an easy target of 1000 likes on this video and 1000 subscribers. So yeah, let's do it guys. Peace out.